Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Taylor, also known as Taylor with an E. And today I am off to Seoul. I haven't been there in so long. I'm so excited. I'm actually going there because a popular YouTube channel here in Korea contacted me. Sorry, I'm looking out for my bus. Saying they wanted to interview me about, you know, some of my YouTube vid videos and life in Korea. So I'm currently off to do that. I'm just here waiting for the bus while, <laughs> you know, oh, there it's coming. So let me get on this bus and then I'll talk to you guys in a minute. on this bus right now. It is so quiet. Probably because it's like the middle of the week. I'm actually using some of my vacation to go do this interview in Seoul. So like I said, I'm so excited. When they contacted me, I was like a little bit unsure at first because I was looking at some of their videos and they're all in Korean. Even the foreigners they have on the channel speak Korean. I don't speak Korean like that. <laughs> so, this is gonna be interesting, but it should be a good time. I'm just excited to go to Seoul again. You know, because like I said, I have not been there in a minute, mostly because of this pandemic. So I haven't really gotten to go anywhere this year. Even around Incheon, I haven't really explored much yet. <sighs> Sorry, I'm a little out of breath. I was rushing, you know, to do my hair this morning. Hey, get a little bit of my makeup done before I get there. So yeah, we're just gonna sit back, relax. I think this bus ride's supposed to be like, about an hour, maybe a little less than an hour until I get there. Then I have to take a subway to the right station, and their studio should be, you know, right outside the station. So, I'm gonna take you guys along with me today. This is my first day in the life video I've done in a minute, so I hope you guys enjoy. made it to the area I want to be in Seoul but I am a little bit early so I think I'm gonna stop in a cafe grab something to eat or drink real quickly because it's snowing pretty pretty hard out here <laughs> a little bit slippery I don't want to be out here and then I'm gonna head over to the studio my mask off. <sighs> ah, I was not ready for that snow. <sighs> but yeah, I just decided to stop in the Starbucks real quick, just to take a little break. I'm traveling all morning, moving all morning. I need to sit down for a minute before this interview. So uh, I'm gonna go over some notes before I get up again and I'm gonna keep going with this day. Alright guys, so I just made it outside the building where the studio is in. I'm about to head up. Uh, it was a little bit tricky getting here. I was trying to find it. This building has a lot of different businesses up there and the whole 
uh, what's it called, directory is all in Korean. So it took me a minute to figure out which floor I'm going to, but I am about to head there now. So let's go. <laughs> I just started filming. Oh my gosh, I am so nervous. This is so nerve-wracking. I've never done anything like this before, but it's so nice. Yeah, so here is the studio. Oh, she's been so nice to me. Oh my gosh. I am awesome. <laughs> All right, so right now we are at the halfway point of my interview. I have been so nervous, guys. I feel like I ramble when I talk. I act the same exact way as I would in front of my own camera, just like messing up all the time. I can't think of my words. But yeah, this is... Ah. Oh, it's been so fun. I can't wait to see these videos when they come out. I just finished up my interview with Awesome Entertainment. Specifically, my interview will be with Awesome Story, like one of their YouTube channel branches. But oh my gosh, it was so fun. Let me get out of this building and figure out a place where I can sit down and tell you guys more about it. But it was such a great experience. Like the woman interviewing me was so nice. You will probably see a lot of different moments of me just like forgetting stuff and figure out my words. But, oh my gosh, it was so amazing. Definitely check out their channel. Most of their content is in Korean for Awesome Story, but I think their other channels, Awesome Korea, they have videos in English. So check that out. I'll catch up with you guys in a minute to tell you more about it. down Gorosugil, which is a famous shopping street here in Shinsudong in the Gangnam area. 
also, fun fact, the only Apple store in all of Korea, I think still in all of Korea, is here in Darsugyo. But yeah, so many amazing shops, so many cute and fantastic cafes and restaurants. It's famous for in the fall when these ginkgo trees line the streets. You can see like some behind me there. It's just so beautiful to walk down the street during that time. But yeah, I highly recommend you guys come out here. I'm actually currently about to go find some food. There's a vegan restaurant I looked up. That's supposed to be really good that's out here. So I am currently on my way there because I'm starving after that interview. But I wanted to kind of take the scenic route down the street because I haven't been here in a minute, you know? Are you open? Uh, we are already closed because oh. we'll have break time. Uh, you can come after 5.30. 5.30? Okay, thank you. So just kidding. Um, that place is closed. Fun fact for those of you planning to live in or visit Korea, usually restaurants have a break time between like 3 p.m. and 5 p.m. or even 5.30. I was kind of hoping, and I knew this, I knew this, but I was kind of hoping this place didn't go by that schedule because sometimes more foreigner type cuisine, world cuisine type restaurants have different hours. So I just wanted to go there to see if, you know, that actually wasn't the case, which it was. So there's also supposed to be a really good, make sure I didn't miss my street, really good taco place over here. <laughs> Let's hope they're open because I've been wanting some tacos and good Mexican places are really hard to find outside of Seoul. So while I'm in Seoul, why not get some tacos? So let's go see if this place is open. We're in luck. It looks like they are open and it smells amazing from out here. I can smell all the taco. So just kidding, they're closed. Or right, they're on break time. But the vegan place will be on break until 5.30. This taco place is just don't break until five. So I found a really cute cafe up right across the street to come hang out and rest while I wait for it to open and get some food. Got some chamomile tea. Oh, I need this for you guys. But anyway, while my tea is cooling off, let me tell you guys about this interview. They had me film four different segments. So the first segment was kind of just an interview about my life in Korea, why I decided to come here, some really good experience I've had while in Korea, and three other segments were actually reactions to a few of my more popular videos in Korea. So my apartment tour, my one month in school lunches, and oh, my day in the life video. So yeah, so I was just kind of sitting there reacting to the video, kind of explaining some things as we were going through the video. But that was a lot of fun because I could have you know, more fun with it and then I could have something to go off of, right? I'm excited to see it once it comes out on the channel, but I'll definitely keep you guys posted once it does. But yeah, it was really cool to see, you know, an actual YouTube entertainment series. It felt like an actual office. Like, this is a pretty legit YouTube company. I mean, they obviously have a lot of YouTube facts, so all their channels do really well. But it was my first time being in a studio like that. People were there working, working on videos. It was like so big. I wish I got like more footage in there to show you guys. I wish I got some good stuff, some good content from me. I was up with my silly self. I told her, if you'll produce any of the bars. Oh, the smell of the cookies in this place. Oh, it is so good. But yeah, oh my gosh, this has been a crazy, crazy day. Anyway, enjoy the rest of this video, guys. The day is wrapping up soon, and I'll catch you guys later.
All right, guys, so I just finished up my late lunch less early dinner at Masa Taco. Oh my gosh, some of the best tacos I've had in Korea. I would say this is right up there with my other favorite taco spot in Seoul called Gusto Taco. But yeah, so I'm headed back to the subway station. In the subway station, I gotta catch this bus back home. Ooh, it's been a long day, so I think I'm gonna end my vlog here. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was fun shooting it today, taking you on a little day of my life adventure. But anyway, I hope you guys have an amazing, wonderful day, and I'll see you next time.